Hey guys, today on Will It Break, we are going to be using the MakerBot Replicator Plus to 3D print a chain and test the durability of it. For the sake of saving time, I have pre-printed the majority of the chain we will be using in the video. But I will be printing one link to show you guys how it is done. To get started, we need to turn on the printer and have it warm up. At this stage, we need to initiate the print. This process will take about 15 minutes. At about 70% into the print, we will need to add the existing printed chain into the newly printed link to complete the loop. At this stage, our newly printed link is looped in with the existing printed links. In total, I've had to do this 7 times to create the length of the chain needed for this video. Now we need to pop out the fresh printed link out of its raft and the chain will be ready to go through a series of weight tests. With the help of two screws, I'm attaching the scale to the board. To get a more accurate reading of how much weight it takes to snap the chain, I attached the scale to a wood board which was held up by a ladder. From the scale to the empty bucket, I looped the chain to suspend the bucket. First thing I'm going to do is place these weights into the bucket. As we see, the weights have a weight of about 10 pounds and the chain looks perfectly fine. Now I'm going to attempt to add the 16 pound sledgehammer and hopefully it will not snap. Now as we can see with the sledgehammer, the chain is a lot more tense but still looks okay. At this point, I decided I'm going to just have my brother apply pressure with his hands until the chain breaks and with the help of this video determine how much weight it took. Well, in conclusion, it snapped a lot sooner than I expected, at about 40 some pounds. Time to go inspect the damage. As we see in the broken chain link that failed, it ripped a whole piece of it out. The chain links are hollow, which is much more impressive that it held up to that much weight. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you have any other ideas for videos, please comment below. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe and like this video. See you in the next video.